The Elements of Non-Euclidean Geometry by D. M. Y. Somerville Chapter 2. Elementary Hyperbolic Geometry Section 40. Sum of the Angles of a Triangle, Defect and Area Join MN, the middle points of AB, AC, and construct the equidistant curve with MN as axis, which passes through B, C, and A. Then the perpendiculars AA prime, BB prime, CC prime, 2MN are all equal. And the angle B prime BM is equal to MAA prime. The angle C prime CN is equal to NAA prime. Denote by ABE the angle which AB makes with the tangent to the equidistant curve at B. The angle B prime BE is a right angle. Then the angle BAC plus ABE plus ACE is equal to B prime BM plus MBE plus C prime CN plus NCE is equal to pi. Hence the sum of the angles of the triangle ABC is equal to pi minus 2CBE. The difference, pi minus the quantity, a plus b plus c, is called the defect of the triangle. Again, the area of the triangle, a, b, c, is equal to b, m, n, c, plus m, a, a, prime, plus n, a, a, prime, which is equal to b, prime, b, c, c, prime. Hence, all triangles with base b, c, and vertex on the other branch of the equidistant curve, which passes through B, C, and A, have the same area and the same angle sum or defect. Now, if we are given two triangles, we can transform one of them into another of the same area and defect, and having one of its sides equal to one of the sides of the other triangle. Let A, B, C, D, E, F be the two triangles and let DF be the greatest of the six sides. Construct an equidistant curve passing through B, C, and A with center C and radius equal to DF. Draw a circle cutting the branch of the equidistant curve on which A lies in A prime. Then the triangle A prime B, C has the same area and defect as the triangle A, B, C and has the sides a prime c equal to df. Again, if the perpendicular bisector of the base bc of a triangle abc meets the other branch of the equidistant curve in a prime, the isosceles triangle a prime bc has the same area and defect as the triangle abc. Hence, if two triangles have the same area, they can be transformed into the same isosceles triangle and have therefore the same defect, and conversely. Now let a triangle ABC with area delta and defect delta be divided into two triangles ABD and ADC with areas delta 1 and delta 2 and defects delta 1 and delta 2. Then, defect delta 1 is equal to pi minus BAD minus B minus ADB. And defect delta 2 is equal to pi minus DAC minus C minus ADC. And therefore, defects delta 1 plus delta 2 is equal to 2 pi minus A minus B minus C minus pi which is equal to pi minus a minus b minus c, which is equal to defect delta. And areas delta 1 plus delta 2 is equal to delta. If area delta 1 is equal to delta 2, then defect delta 1 is equal to delta 2, and area delta is equal to 2 times delta 1, and defect delta is equal to 2 times delta 1. Hence, the defect is proportional to the area or area delta is equal to lambda times the quantity pi minus a minus b minus c. The value of this constant lambda depends upon the units of angle and area which are employed. But when these have been chosen, it is given absolutely. The Elements of Non-Euclidean Geometry This book was written by D. M. Y. Somerville 
MA and Doctor of Science. It was published by the Open Court Publishing Company in London, G. Bell and Sons LTD in 1919, and now is in the public domain. It is being read by Jim Renholt with programming and illustrations by Jim Renholt in 2019. Thank you for listening.